playtime's over, pet. Ah, oh, I love this time of year. The dickheads start popping up wherever you look. What do you want, Mizora? Drop the attitude and perk up your ears. You've got a new mission. Absolute's cult has gone and grabbed one of Zariel's assets. A devil, and a powerful one at that. They're locked up in the cult's fortress, Moonrise Towers, and you're getting him out. <clears throat> Clause Z, section 13. Should promised soul refuse obeyance or neglect duty, the pact holder shall cast the promised into a vernus as a lemure. I'll make it simple. Will fails or refuses, and he turns to a thick blob of stink flesh and sinks to a vernus. Now, be a good boy and play fetch, pup, or you'll spend an eternity sizzling in the hells. Mazora's words may be flippant, but they are tinged with desperation. She cannot afford for Will to fail this mission. This may be your best chance to negotiate Will out of his pact. Oh, and what condition is that? Your mind links with Will's, drawn in by his increasing panic. What are you doing? Will relaxes, and your connection fades. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? You actually think you hold the winning hand? Fine. I'll play your game. But I amend the pact once the mission's done, not before. Clause F, Section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soul bearer's fulfillment of related obligation. Now, to Moonrise, pet. And do mind the shadows. They've been especially hungry. <laughs> <laughs> 